I think when we're looking at potential students for applying to here to the University of Miami, we're looking at students who have obviously a, a good academic background, but we're also looking for the student who's motivated. We're looking for a well-rounded student who is um, interested in patient care and also interested in research, who is uh, committed to becoming a physical therapist and recognizing the physical therapy profession. And then you're also looking for somebody with personality. I think some of the best therapists are those that are active listeners and that they can communicate with uh, patients. We look for the ability or for students who have had a background in doing things beyond just their grades and just their their coursework. We like to produce people who don't always just accept what's being told them but in fact want to know what is the evidence so that, that they can be a part of, of the process that will answer many of the questions that remain out there. We must be educators and motivators so that the therapist today has to as quickly as possible not only know what to do for a patient but they must educate that person on how they can help themselves and then they must motivate them to do so. Financial aid or financial assistance is always a primary concern. We here at the University of Miami have graduate assistantships for almost all of our students. They are competitive. The students apply for the various kinds and they're usually teaching assistants with faculty members that teach in the first year of the program. In addition to those, we also have several scholarship programs for students. But one of the things we've done in the PT program is to block the tuition so that you pay the same amount of tuition dollars from the first semester to the last semester. The block tuition has been probably one of the best benefits that we've been able to do and to try to address the, the rising cost of education for our current students as well as those in the future.